Okay, so I have a patient who needs um, heated humidified uh, air, sorry, um, using a high flow nasal cannula. So I don't have the actual humidifier, I just have the water reservoir and the tubing. So we're going to pretend that this is um, in the humidifier. So this is a heated pass over um, humidifier and what it's going to do is it's going to filter in the air through or in, yeah, filter the oxygen in through um, an air filter and it's going to go in this end. Then you can see it's going to go down, pass over. This is the heated um, plate down here. And once it passes over that, it's going to come out of this end into the nasal cannula. So um, these two are going to plug into the humidifier, these two holes here. And then, um, and then this tubing here pops out. And you can feed it up to your water bag, which will be on your uh, mobile pole. And um, so this particular humidifier has a float. The blue float is in there, and that's what's gonna keep your water at the um, level that it needs to be. So it's gonna keep it here at this, where this um, black arrow marks, and that's gonna be the water level. Um, so the, as far as the tubing, um, this bigger end is going to hook onto the actual humidifier where this end is going to connect to your high flow nasal cannula and um, so there is actual an uh, integrated um, temperature sensor that's in this um, part of the tubing and um, so because of that you don't need any temperature probes on the tubing any external ones um, so for, um, we're going to keep the temperature at about 37 degrees Celsius for a patient. And, um, I set my FiO2 at 50% at 15 liters per minute, um, which is the ratio is going to be 1.7 to one. And then I'm, um, going to multiply that 2.7 by 15 and get 40.5 liters per minute. So with this plugged into the humidifier, this plugged in the humidifier, this plugged into my nasal cannula, um, I'm going to set my FiO2, then I'm going to turn on my, um, um, my oxygen, and um, yeah, then my patient will be getting heated um, water vapor.